Hi guys, Dan's Dollars here. We are back with Dan's coin review and valuations. And in this video, we are definitely going pre-decimal with this one. It is the 1865 half penny coin. As always with the reviews on the channel, we'll start off with the design on the coin. We'll move on to the mintage figures, exactly how many of the coin was made for circulation. And then we'll finish off with the true value of the coin in perfect uncirculated and also in circulated conditions. So today we'll start off on the right hand side of the coin with the portrait of Queen Victoria looking to the left. We've got the lettering Victoria for Queen Victoria on the left hand side and the lettering around the top and down the right hand side of the coin stands for by the grace of God, Queen of all Britons, Defender of the Faith. We now look to the left hand side of the coin where we see the Siege of Britannia design, a definite fan favourite. We've got the trident in left hand with the shield bearing the Union flag in the right. Halfpenny, the coin's face value at the top in lettering, 1865, the year of issue at the bottom. We've got the lighthouse to the left hand side of the Britannia and the ship sailing away in the sea on the right. The Britannia design is still used in UK circulation today. It was on the 50 pence until 2008, until it got replaced with the segment of the shield. And it has been re-released from 2015 on the two pound coin. A really nice Britannia design, that one. Definitely standing out on the two different colours there on the £2 coin. So back to the 1865 half penny. How many were released in 1865? The answer should be on the screen now. The number on the screen then, 8,064,000. That is still quite a high mintage figure for the time. But the good news, a perfect uncirculated coin will fetch you around the 80 to to £100 mark. Definitely not complaining with that one. And a good quality coin like we see here will fetch in the region of 15 to 18 pounds. Again, definitely a vast difference with these half pennies, old pennies between a good quality and a perfect uncirculated. Maybe just because the mintage figures are still so high, there's a lot of good quality ones out there. Just very few uncirculated ones. If your coin is in super warm condition, you're still going to get a couple of pounds for the coin. Again, it is over 150 years old. And a couple of pounds, not too bad, 400 times the coin's face value. As always, if you do have any questions, queries, or if you'd like to see your coin featured in a review video, please do comment it below. Have a great Sunday, everyone. Stay safe, and as always, guys, thanks for watching.